Okay, dokie guys, uh, welcome back again to the channel. So today I have a very short video for you as you can see from the title of the video and the thumbnail on how you can install car mods on a set of Corsa. Although a set of Corsa is uh, let's say a fairly old game now, but believe it or not there are uh, many many people each and every single day getting into the game and of course they want to know how they can install mods uh, especially car mods and um, uh, map mods so they can enjoy uh, their uh, favorite car uh, the procedure it's uh, really really easy i'm going to show you the automatic procedure which is using content manager and i'm going to show you also uh, the um, I'm going to show you also the manual mod because um, let's say that more than 90% of the mods out there now can be installed in automatic with uh, content manager but there are some uh, mods especially some old mods that you need to do manually but uh, if you don't want to use content manager for any weird reason we should say you can also install the mods manually into your game okay then without any further ado let's move on first thing we need to do is basically of course getting the mods and you can go to google and just search a set of course a car mods or, or a set of course a mods and you will be greeted with many many pages that you can uh, download car mods map mods and everything else that you can download for a set of Corsa my personal preference uh, is a race department which um, it's not very user friendly especially for beginners to get mods in this uh, web page but if you want uh, everything let's say everything uh, including uh, uh, content manager and all the mods that you can have for a set of Corsa race department is the site to go you need to create an account it's free and then you can get everything in this page but if you just want to grab the mods there are many other uh, options like a set of Corsa club where you can also get content manager and they have 75 cars and 282 tracks that you can uh, download and use and uh, it is a set of Corsa world which is one of my favorite when it comes to car mods but anyway uh, any website that have has mods with uh, for a set of Corsa you can use them they are a little bit finicky for downloading them because you need to click on different links they all have uh, of course um, uh, ads showing up so you need to be careful where you click so for this one we're gonna give it a try here on a set of worlds so let's say for example we want to download um, uh, this one here Maserati MC20 which is a new car that I don't have basically in this page you click on the car that you want to download then you go uh, down here on uh, this section and here you have the general information about the car then you go to the variants and you see the variants uh, of the cars uh, that you have and if you like it then you can go ahead and uh, download it to download it you go a little bit further down then you click on the link download but now you will be created with uh, some um, uh, with some ads for uh, this site so after that you might want to click on download file with high speed so let's just click it so you see it will greet you with an ad you need to close this and then if you click it again it will get you to the link uh, to the actual link so usually when you click for the first time uh, uh, oh, this happens also in other pages it will get you to um, uh, an ad then you need to close that and then you need to click that again it might be two times or three times it depends on the page and then when you will see download file and when you will see the name of the actual file and the actual size this is the website where you have to download some pages have to generate the link so they will greet you with another ad usually even uh, when you get to, to the file so again be careful when you click because um, yeah then you have to click again download to the link again uh, as I said the ad and now you have to wait again and then download again it will give you again with another ad oh my god let's hit it again okay now this is the actual download so be careful be patient and just watch for the download uh, on your browser when it will begin that is going to be the queue that you are downloading so do not click on every page or every ad that you might also see the download button so be careful with that so let's wait for the download and we'll pick up from there 
Okay now, the mod has uh, been downloaded and you have to keep in mind a general rule about the mods. Basically in most of the cases where the mods uh, comes in uh, a zip file, it means that it uh, most probably, or let's say 99% of the cases, it can be downloaded and installed in automatic through Content Manager. So what you have to do next, basically it's really simple. You just open uh, Content Manager and uh, by the way, if you don't want to know how to install Content Manager, CSP and everything else, which makes uh, uh the uh the life of using a set of course are really really easy and it takes it uh, really to the next level i have a specific video on that and i will leave the link on the video description so go ahead and watch that one first and then come for this one if you haven't already so you open content manager then you go to the folder where you have the mods and it is really easy basically just grab the mod and just launch it here on content manager and that's it you will see here a green thing that it is downloading it will do the check first and if uh, that mod is installable with content manager you will see this one here and you will see the install button so basically just click on install and it will install if that mod is not installable through content manager you will see an error and basically you will have to do the manual install of the mod and and, uh, not through content manager then you just remove it and if we go to the course now for example let's go to Maserati and find it here M M M M M. okay Maserati MC 20 and there it is now you can take the car and use it and have fun with it this is the same procedure with 99 percent of the car mods that you will find everywhere now let's go with the manual mod the manual mod basically it's um, also really simple the only difference is that you have to find the root folder of a set of corsa and uh, drag and drop the files that you have downloaded to the car files that uh, you have in the main folder of a set of corsa Okay, and if for some reason you don't know how to find the root folder of a set of course, it's basically uh, really simple. You just go to uh, the Steam application because set of course is playable through Steam. Then you cl uh, right click on a set of course, go to manage and then browse local files and it will get you immediately uh, to the root folder of uh, a set of course. So just a second here, let me open this. Okay, this is the main folder of a set of course. Okay, let's move it to the side. Let's open the mod that we got. So to get to the car uh, folder in the main uh, Assetto Corsa uh, folder, you go to content and then you have here cars. And as you see, we have all the folder cars uh, that you can use in Assetto Corsa. And you guessed it, it's pretty easy to do the manual install. You just uh, grab the files and put them into the car folder, into the main folder of a set of Corsa. Just be careful when you drag them, be careful not to drop them into another folder because they will end up in there and you will not be able to use them. Make sure to get them into the cars folder. So you need to drop them here and not into a highlighted folder. Or maybe you can do cop and uh, copy and then paste, of course, into the folder and if we scroll down again to the M here let's go to the M you will see that we have the two folders the Maserati MC 20 uh, 2021 and this one basically these two folders that we have done through content manager so this is the manual uh, the manual way how you uh, install uh, the cars uh, or the car mods uh, into a set of Corsa again it's really really easy through content manager follow the link in the video description on how you can uh, download and install content manager and everything that comes with it it's really really easy you just drag and drop them and they will uh, install automatically but again if you come across into 
uh, uh, car mod that uh, it's not installable through content manager and you will get an error uh, for the installation then you can do the manual install with the method that I told you so basically that was it I ended a little bit longer than I thought but anyway thanks very much for watching guys if you want any more uh, stuff for, uh, uh, with the set of course are related on how to use content manager and everything else just leave a comment on the comment section and i will try to make a video on that topic anyway thanks again for watching don't forget to subscribe like and all that good stuff and as usual i will catch you guys on the next one bye bye